Now, let me tell you the group of drugs which are used in the treatment of closed angle glaucoma. Now, in case of closed angle glaucoma, remember the primary treatment is the surgery. Right? The primary treatment is surgery. So, for Closed angle glaucoma, the definitive treatment is surgery, right? So, what is that particular surgery you do, right? What is that particular surgery you do, right? The surgery is laser peripheral iridotomy, right? It is laser surgery, right? Laser peripheral iridotomy okay right so our other surgical option what we have is surgical peripheral iridectomy iridotomy is opening of the iris whereas we have another option that is surgical peripheral iridectomy right so these are the surgical options which are available for the treatment of the closed angle glaucoma now but preceding the surgery right just before the surgery the intraocular tension should be reduced now so before surgery right before surgery to reduce the intraocular tension the drugs what we use is we have the cholinomimetic drugs which are myotics right cholinomimetic drugs which are myotics by causing meiosis the outflow the aqueous outflow will be increased next now before the onset of the surgery in order to reduce the intraocular pressure we can also use acetazolamide acetazolamide because this particular acetazolamide it is a carbonic anhydrase inhibitor it will reduce the aqueous secretion or we can also use the osmotic diuretics the osmotic diuretics are Example is mannitol. Right, the osmotic diuretics is mannitol. Okay, so before the surgery, in order to reduce the intraocular tension, we use this cholinomimetics, acetazolamide, or osmotic diuretics, which is a mannitol. Now, whereas you take the other agents, like you take the beta blockers or you take the alpha 2 agonists, the onset of action of the other agents is too slow in this situation that is the reason why they are not used now you take in case of acute cases right in acute cases remember actually your acetazolamide is the oral formulation right but in case of acute conditions this acetazolamide is given intravenously so intravenous acetazolamide is given okay intravenous acetazolamide is given in case of acute conditions next a point that you have to remember is all the patients with primary acute angle closure glaucoma should undergo prophylactic laser peripheral iridotomy to the unaffected eye right not only the treatment has to be given for the affected eye right the point what you should remember is even in the unaffected eye they have to undergo the prophylactic laser peripheral iridotomy all right so this is completely about the treatment of closed angle glaucoma the primary option is the surgery that is laser peripheral iridotomy or surgical peripheral iridectomy next before the surgery the intraocular tension has to be reduced 
For that we give the cholinomimetic drugs that is myotics and acetazolamide and osmotic diuretics. Whereas the other agents in this situation the onset of action is too slow. And in acute cases we have to give intravenous acetazolamide. So this is completely about the treatment of glaucoma.